What are Modi and Putin hoping to achieve then from this visit? Well, good morning. Um, this is very much a return visit to one that Putin made uh, in December last year uh, when Modi described uh, the relationship with Russia as having a unique place in India's foreign policy. Uh, the agenda then was about um, oil, weapons and nuclear energy and there's a very similar agenda this year. Uh, as you said, India is hoping to uh, conclude the most important defence deal with Russia in uh, more than a decade. Uh, they're seeking to purchase uh, the most advanced S-400 uh, air defence systems and there's discussion as well about buying helicopters, submarine, warships. So this is a very important relationship for both countries. India sees Russia as a key supplier of weapons to help it keep the strategic balance with China in the Asian region. And Russia views India as an extremely important defence market and is facing competition from the US and France in recent years. But it's been India's most important defence partner for more than 50 years and it intends to stay that way. So Modi is assured of a very warm welcome in Russia and he and Putin will be having a private dinner tonight uh, soon after his arrival. So just, just how strong are the ties between these nations? What is, what is each country going to get out of this relationship? Well, Russia's been seeking to, to develop its ties with India more deeply, uh, in part in reaction to the sanctions that were imposed on it by the European Union and the US um, over the Ukraine crisis. Uh, last year, Modi made clear to Putin that uh, he didn't agree with sanctions, and uh, in this case, uh, he was much more supportive of Putin than other countries. And uh, both countries are seeking to strengthen their trade ties. India's foreign minister said yesterday that they were hoping to triple trade in the next 10 years to something like $30 billion. So it's a growing and important relationship for Russia, uh, help balance the sanctions uh, imposed on it. And for India, it's an important counterbalance uh, in the contest with China. Russia's seen not only as a defense supplier, but a very important supplier of energy. Oil deals were discussed last year. They're on the table again this year. And Russia is likely to be building, uh, or expanding in fact, a, a nuclear reactor uh, for India to help it improve uh, its energy supply there. Both countries see that they can get a lot out of this relationship.